Hi, this is John Sullivan with Advisor One, and I'm here with Marv Tuttle, who is the Executive Director and CEO of the Financial Planning Association, talking a little bit about the show, how it's gone, and you know, with that in mind, how has it gone so far, Marv? A great, great show. It has. And uh, based on you know where we've been in the last couple of years, it's kind of a return to stability, a little bit of sanity for yeah. our members, yeah. and growth in this conference. We grew up, you know, have 2,500 members here. And uh, based on last year, that's a 10 to 15 percent growth in our attendance. Have you had any kind of sense of the mood? I mean, is there a palpable sense of that we're coming out of this, that things are back on track? Yeah, I think there's a cautious optimism. Cautious optimism but, yeah. you know, I mean, we're still uncertain yeah. with the economy and unemployment, sure. those types of issues. But uh, I think, you know, our planners, many of them that I'm talking about, are, you know, regularly seeing new clients these days, and that feels good. Fantastic. Now, Marv, if there was one thing that you wanted the advisors to take away, the attendees to take away, what would that be? Well, I, you know, I think, you know, that uh, that FPA is here to, you know, fully serve them and be their advocate. Uh, as you might have seen at the conference, we've been really focused on the work that we've been doing in Washington, D.C., uh, advocating for our members, looking at where we can have an appropriate regulation of financial planning and in and our efforts to really get the fiduciary standard in place. So those are the things I think we've accomplished this year, and I think they'll serve our members and consumers well. What, what has been really the overarching theme? Would it be that fiduciary theme that you just mentioned? Has there, there been others as well? Well, I think uh, certainly regulation has been a focus coming out of financial reform, has been uh, an area of emphasis for us. And then secondly, uh, just to let members know through our new branding campaign, we've come out with a brand new uh, revamped website that's going to better serve consumers and our members that, you know, we're at it. We're back in business full time. I mean, we've had to do what we needed to do to stay in business over these past couple of years, but uh, we're excited about the future. Now, when you mentioned staying in business, how are the numbers for FPA uh, in terms of recruiting new members? Well, we're 24,000 members right now. We're about 10% down over the past two years, but we're in the last five to six months start steadily growing. You know, like last month, we grew 150 new members, so that's positive sign. Fantastic. Can you talk a little bit about the initiatives for FPA moving into the end of 2010 and then into the beginning of 2011? Well, I, we have some strategic priorities and certainly branding the organization in a way that uh, maybe we can have a, uh, a broader recognition within the financial services industry of what FPA does and attracting new people to that are not only financial planning practitioners but are allied to financial planning that support financial planning. We want to do that. Secondly is the fiduciary education initiative that we have where we're going to be spending a lot of time educating, training our members as to how this fiduciary standard comes out and how they need to be serving their clients. Growing our communities of interest. Uh, we've developed some new communities this year in terms of women and money, uh, our next-gen community, um, just really trying to tackle and create special interests within our organization so we can have more of a, what we'll call a community of communities concept. So those are the primary initiatives we're focused on right now. Fantastic. Now, I'm sure you probably don't want this next question, but I know you get started on 2011's conference probably on Wednesday. So is there anything that we should know, anything special uh, that you're, you're planning for 2011 well, that you I know? Mean, we just had a task force meeting. They're starting to roll out uh, oh, all the on. different yeah. uh, things they're thinking about, this community concept is is kind of very large within their initial conversations September 15th through the 18th next year in San Diego. San Diego. Wonderful. Look forward to seeing you there. Thank okay. you, Marv. Appreciate, you, it. Appreciate it.